Hello everyone, welcome to Encryption, the tech tips and tutorial channel. This video is going to be about how to reset the forgotten user's password on Ubuntu Linux which is installed as a Windows subsystem for Linux in Windows 11 operating system. So let's get started. Before actually learning how to reset the password, we are going to understand the problem scenario. Let's open Ubuntu by pressing the Windows key and typing Ubuntu in the search box. This is a Linux terminal in Windows 11. Let's first verify which version of Ubuntu is installed as the Windows subsystem for Linux or WSL by typing cat space slash etc slash os dash release. Here we can see the Ubuntu version is 22.04.1 LTS Jammy Jellyfish. Now moving on, let's do something that requires the user's password. For example, sudo apt update space hyphen y. This command is used to update all the packages that are already installed on the Ubuntu Linux from its remote repository and requires an administrative privilege or the super user privilege. The user named Sanjay in the system is a sudoer or a super user. So it can run any administrative but you will need to enter the password of the user here don't confuse it's not asking you to enter the root password but the user's password which is currently logged on or uh, sanjay in my case further uh, we assume that we have forgotten the password we try entering the correct password three times but we fail each time now let's learn how to reset the forgotten password the process is uh, we will change the default configuration so that when uh, we log on next time we'll log in as the root user then we will uh, reset the user's password and finally set the default login user to the current one which is sanjay in my case let's start by opening the command prompt in ubuntu version 20.04 and earlier we had to use the command ubuntu version number config space dash dash default dash user and the username root to switch the default login user to root but this doesn't work in ubuntu version 22.04 so for 22.04 uh, you need to type as ubuntu.exe space config space dash dash default dash user space root and you should hit enter this will open the Ubuntu app with the default user logged in as root on its next launch. Now close the command from open the Ubuntu Linux. And here we can see by default it's logged in as a root user. If you haven't noted down the username that you want to change the password of, you can quickly check it by typing cat space slash etc slash passwd. From here, you can get the username. Clearing the screen with the Ctrl plus L shortcut keys, let's set a new password for the user. Type the command passwd space the username, which in my case is Sanjay, and type the password. The password will not be visible on the screen as you type it. Retype the password to confirm. The password of the user Sanjay is now reset and we can see the message from passwd that the password updated successfully. Now type ubuntu.exe space config space dash dash default dash user space the username which in my case is Sanjay and hit enter. That's it. We are all done. Now when you launch the Ubuntu WSL next time on Windows 11, it will open up with the user Sanjay logged in by default. Let's close the command prompt and check. As you can see, we are logged in as the user Sanjay. Now we know the password so we can run any task that requires an administrative privilege or the super user privilege. Let's see by running the command sudo apt update space hyphen y. It's asking for the password of the user Sanjay. Type the password and hit enter. And we can see the command that requires super user privilege executes successfully. 
Okay friends, this is how we can reset a user's password in Ubuntu 22.04 which is installed on Windows 11 as a Windows subsystem for Linux. That's all for this video. I hope the video was useful to you. Please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. See you on other videos. Till then, have an excellent time. Goodbye.